That derecho was something. We all saw it, felt it, did something. So maybe you have some straw, scissors. If you do, you have a little scientific know-how and you're gonna be making your own special kind of music in today's Science Minute Challenge. So here is our science guy, Steve Spangler. How to make music with a straw. I know, it's compelling, but watch this. Normally, if you just take a regular straw and you blow through the straw, you get no sound at all. In order to get sound, you need vibration. In order to get vibration, we're gonna turn this into a reed. Watch what you're gonna do. You're gonna take this and, and bite down on it and pull with your teeth. Don't break your teeth, okay? Got it. See how you're flattening it like that? You try to flatten the straw. Now, you wanna take your scissors and you're just gonna cut the edges off like this. So there's a little cut. That should be great. Let's try this. Now, this goes in your mouth and now you just, uh, you blow. I know, you're excited. Now, you could just make another straw a different size. So for example, I've cut this one. So see how these are different sizes, right? So now watch. Vibration, but wait, it gets better. Look at this. If you cut it now while you're blowing the air through it, listen. It's getting dangerous, so I'm gonna show you how to make a trombone. Look, this end goes in here, and you get a trombone. So now watch, you're just making it longer and shorter. That's not annoying at all. Try every straw that you can find. You're bound to come up with something great. I'm Steve Spangler, and that's your Science Minute. Mrs. Spangler is a wonderful woman. <laughs> I was just oh, going to say, Kim, do, you think, do you think Steve's family asked him to go play outside during this pandemic a time or two? <laughs>